Buenas tardes, runner afternoon walk with Micah. He sells a little bit of a sunburn and ghost. And there is a rainbow in the sky right there. You can see it. It's actually, it's a little bit sunny and it's a little bit rainy. And there is a rainbow. I think it's gone. No, it's still kind of see it. Yeah, you can see it behind the trees. Well, anyways, today we did our chest and tricep workout. Uh, Aiden joined in. So we got to do assisted reps, which I always prefer over drop sets. Uh, I just feel like that last rep is so much harder and does um, that much more damage to the to the muscle. And everything, everything, every rep you do in a set works is to get you to that last rep, which uh, is the most beneficial rep. And uh, getting that sister rep in with a helper is the best. So I recommend having a workout partner, but drop sets are still as good. Uh, you can actually see, you can actually see what kind of progress you can have from week to week doing one drop set to failure with um, Aiden's, Aiden's workouts because uh, he, he started fresh with me. So if you go back to when we did the first father and son workout, that was his first workout. So you're getting to see the progress he's having from day one uh, up to today. And then you'll see all the progress he's gonna have up to his birthday. And I was telling him today that um, I'm pretty sure his bench will get to 135, no problem by the time the year ends. And that he'll get his deadlift to 225. For, uh, if we keep just doing one set to failure uh, from last week to th this week on chest day he gained uh, like two or three reps on all his exercises um, or he added or he added weight and next week he's adding more weight and he's not he's not really bulking or cutting he's in that newbie phase where he's gonna keep uh, gaining strength week after week and this was the same thing that happened to me um, just under two years ago um, uh, in 2022 on July 4th, 4th of July, I started working out consistently and I had the same progress, but I was actually doing three sets to failure, which I found out later is too much. All you need to do is one set to failure, get to failure, and that's it. Go on to the next exercise. And I feel like um, I've evolved over the last two years. And right now this uh, routine I have now is probably the ideal routine to have while working out at home because it requires the least amount of equipment and you can probably even get away with even less equipment than I have um, I even made homemade dumbbells and we're actually got a welder so we're gonna make uh, better homemade dumbbells we ordered some collars on Amazon and we're gonna make better homemade dumbbells um, I'll make a video when I do that I'm gonna use galvanized steel and put on um, do some welding but you'll see, you'll see more of that later on. And I'm actually gonna add a polo bar too, because apparently there is a hurricane uh, coming close to Nicaragua. And when that happens on the, on the Caribbean side, there's usually a lot of rain that uh, happens on the Pacific side, which, which is where I am. So it'd be good to get a polo bar. I'll weld one up, make videos, and put that under the roof so that we can work out even if it's pissing rain outside and that's a very long intro enjoy the video like and subscribe and come back tomorrow for back and biceps and say bye micah bye first thing we do on monday morning is we do ring support holds you can hear the flies frying in the back we made some fly traps over there and it sounds like they're getting destroyed and um, uh, Aiden's gonna do the ring support hold. Um, anything near a minute is very good on the ring support hold. Aiden's gonna do a um, regular grip. And when he, gets, when he gets really good with the regular grip, we're gonna get him to turn the rings out all the way like I am. And I'm gonna do the rings turned out. And my goal is to get anywhere from 50 seconds to a minute. And let's see what we can do here. Do it.
That was really good. That was a fucking... That was really good. Oh, I think that was... The, for sure, that was more than a minute. Shit. High five. Being stronger. Where's the, where's the burn? Your chest? Yeah. That's why it's a good it's a good chest warm-up and your triceps. <laughs> it, actually, it actually burns your shoulders, your triceps, your biceps when you turn them out. And I even... Turned out kind of. And your forearms. You feel it everywhere. It's a really good warm-up. Nice static hold. Okay. Papa's turn. So last week, I think on Monday, I did around 50 seconds. Anything over 50 seconds is really good. Be careful on that grass. The ants are going to bite you. Aiden, Aiden did uh, a minute a minute 19 with his arms um, in a comfortable position. So he's going to start turning his arms out a little bit to see if he can get stronger in the, if the rings turned out. And um, so my goal is to get one minute with my arms turned all the way out. And um, today, the lighter I get, the easier it's going to be. Uh, so when I drop under 200 pounds, I should be able to hold it for longer than a minute. And when that happens, I'm going to figure out how to make it more difficult. Or maybe start doing some kind of other uh, ring exercises. But right now, my goal is to hold this for a minute. And there's a timer coming in, which will make it a little bit easier to... to um, not easier, but give you an idea of maybe hold it for a couple more seconds. Just to squeeze out a few more seconds in the ring support hold. And let's see how long I can hold it for. Barbecue by the uh, electricity. I think that was pretty good. I think that for sure that was more than 50 seconds. There's a nice, nice burn in my chest, which is what we want to warm up the chest and triceps. And then onto the incline bench press. And the next exercise we do is the incline bench press. And last week I did 155 for nine reps. So this week I'm going to do 155 again. Uh, today I weigh 11, 111 or 211.6 for my cut. And on the ring support hold, I held that for 55 seconds, which is very good. Um, it looks like I'll have one minute very soon. And Aiden is gonna do incline bench press first. Last week he did nine reps with 55 pounds. And this week he has 55 pounds on again. And I'm gonna call it, he's gonna be able to do uh, 10 or 11 reps or maybe even more just from doing one set to failure. And you can hear the flies game. You can hear the flies game barbecued in the back on my contraption I made. It smells like burning flesh. Okay, Shmei, you got this. You got 11 reps, or I'm gonna disown you as my son, okay? okay. That's fair, I think. Yeah, sir. Turn square, 11 reps, you're disowned. Ready? Yeah. You go up, bring it down, it's all you. Yeah, bring it up here more. One. Right there. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. You got this. Eight. Nine. Light weight. You need way more than 11. Ten. Ah, 11. Yeah, this will be me. 12. Wait, wait. These are a lot stronger. Go, 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 go. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 it's going forward. Go, I'm not, I'm not lifting it. I'm not lifting it. Okay, go, 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 go. Can you drop it yourself? Try to do one more. Ready? Push, 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 push. This last one, this last one. Push, 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 push. And you're good. Fuck, you're alive. 
Do 12? Or yeah, 13? 12. Yeah, so let's see 12. You did three more reps. So you did three more reps with one set to failure. If he did, if he probably did two or three sets to failure, he would have probably not have recovered in time and uh, he wouldn't have lost any reps. Yeah. And this just proved this is exactly what happened with me. So I wasn't recording when I started working out. But every week, when you have newbie gains, you're doing one set to failure. It's all you need. Every, rep, every week, you add five pounds to the bar, or you're adding uh, two, three, four reps to the bar. And next week, we're going to add 60 pounds. And Aiden, watch Aiden do um, uh, maybe nine, ten reps. It's, it's crazy how, how it works. And uh, it's my turn. Super crazy, no? Yeah. Did you feel good adding all those reps? Yeah. Cutting sucks. With my shirt, with my pants. Yeah, me too. With your jeans shirt. Okay, bye, guys. Here. So, How much is this? One fifty-five. So I should. I should, I'm probably gonna start this a little higher. Whatever. Okay, ready? Yeah. Yeah, this actually looks like it's. Good. I got a different height than you are. Okay, you're taller than me. Yeah, so my head's just a little bit higher on the, on the bar. Okay, ready? Yeah. How many reps did you get last time? Nine. Let's try to do it to eight. Oh, fuck, that hurt. How'd that hurt? What are you doing? Let's put the bar. You're a professional spotter. Here you go, let's. Trying to get it to eat. It's your subconscious. No? There I go! <coughs> oh, fuck. Oh, that was good. That's perfect. See, I, I lift actually, I lifted that wrong. I used a lot of energy taking the bar up. Yeah. Because it was so far, far back. That was good. The two sister reps really helped get me where I need to be. Even though I only got seven reps by myself, we still accomplished the same task of the failure and he didn't help me those last two reps, which you feel uh, did a lot of damage. And on to the next exercise. The next exercise we do is the bench press with the barbell. Last week I did 185 seven times. So I'm gonna do 185 again uh, because I wanna try and get to fail between eight and 10 reps while cutting and bulking, but I'm cutting right now. And uh, Aiden did seven reps with 65 pounds. So this week he should be able to get 10. I'm calling 10. If he doesn't do 10, he's getting disowned as my son. And he's gonna have to go find another house to live in. Okay, Aiden? Yeah. So see if he can do it. Okay. Let's do this, baby. 10 reps so I don't get disowned. Yeah. Bring shame to your family. Huh? Bring shame on your family. Yeah. Drop it down around your nipple area. Yeah, that's perfect. It's the perfect technique. One. Oh, shit. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine. Let's get the ten. You got this. You got this. You got this. Ten. Push, 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 push. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. I'm not touching it. You're swinging it around like a monkey. Ten, drop it down, and I'll help you with this one. Go push. Push, 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 push. It's going. It's going. It's going. You good? Yeah. Perfect. So you got 10. You got 10 by himself, like I called it. He's adding two reps to, his, uh, to both his benches. Next week he's going to do 70 pounds. And uh, he should be able to do, I think he's going to be able to do 8 to 9 reps next week with 5 more pounds. And then that one, that last rep was a key rep. And uh, my turn. Ready? Yeah. 
think it's pretty, getting pretty much pretty easier for me. Now. Everything is fucking easy. Your body's getting used to all this shit. My hip feels like it's okay. You good, bro? Yeah. You've been in for it, I know. Okay. You ready? I didn't warn you. Huh? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Uh, I can just dead this like that. That's why you don't. Yeah, that's good. So I got uh, seven by myself, just like last week. And I hope you do two more. And that's it. So all we need, on to the next exercise. Video. The next exercise we do is dumbbell Chest flies. Chest day. We do dumbbell. Crying. We do dumbbell flies. <laughs> last week I did nine reps of thirties. Emotional. So I'm going to do nine, um, nine reps again probably this week with 30 pound weights. Aiden, I think he did 10 pounds last week, but he did more than 10 reps. So he's going to be doing 12.5 uh, today. And then I'll give him, I'll help him with a few assisted reps at the end. He'll do the same with me. And then we'll go on to the next exercise. Just from one, one set is all we need. This is a bit more, um... Okay, Aiden's doing dumbbell flies. The other way, the other way. The other way. This way? The other way. You go the other way. No. Your arms are fine. You this way. Yeah, that way. Yeah. No, no. Put, put your arms. Hold the... Hold this. Hold it. Or yeah, however you think you can hold it without fall down. I think the other way is easier. The other way? Yeah, I think having... I think having... Yeah. No, no, no. No, no, no. You had it with the other good. Never mind. Yeah, we good. What? Hop out. What are you doing? No, I don't go to school. No iPad. No iPhone. No computer. Nothing. So you better. Here you go. <laughs> So I moved the fly trap I made, and in all these little black specks are the corpses of the flies. Look at that. Look at how well that worked. And then to be continued on this side. So I, I upgraded the, the trap, I added another uh, racket, and I had a bag of dog shit underneath, and the catch it's still there, and it's very attractive for the flies. 
It's okay, the kids are doing school now because we started work out late. So you guys can learn Spanish. So Espanol. No. Okay. Escuela en Lina. Okay. The next exercise we do is dips. And this week, Aiden's going to use the heaviest band I have, the thickest band I have, to help him do assisted dips. And I'm going to do... And then actually, when he's done, done that, I'll probably help him. I'll try to give him a couple of sister reps. And I'm going to do dips without the band. And then I'm going to add a different band when I can't do any more reps to get those assisted reps in. And I should be able to do f five... And Aiden, I'm not sure, but how many is he gonna do? Let's see what he does. Go jump up, put your knees in there. Yeah, jump up, do a support hold. Get your knees in there. Yeah, and then dip down. And go and push up. Push up, yeah, push up. One. Two, no, you're fine. You're doing, still working out. Your elbows are bent. Two. Three. Four, is it too, too heavy? Yes. Just keep doing it. Just keep doing it. See what you can do. See what you can do. Four. Take a swing. Go. Five. Six. Keep going. Just keep going. It's fine. Just keep going. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Go. Ten. Lean, lean forward while you're doing it. Work more of your chest. Yeah. Ten. Eleven. Keep going. Keep going. Lean forward. Yeah. Go, go. Yeah, yeah. See, it's good. I'm not sure how many that is. Twelve or thirteen. Just keep going. See, the band helps. Next week, you can use the lower, the thinner band. Go push, 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 push. Here, I'll give you, I'll give you a push, push, and push. Go, 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 go. Push, 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 push. Okay, that's it. Now what? Now you jump off to the back. Slide the band off. Yeah, like that. So that wasn't too much. It was actually good. My arms are more fried than my chest. Yeah, because if you lean forward, you do more chest. If you lean back, you do more arms. But that we're working triceps and biceps. No, triceps and chest. So you're good. And now it's my turn. And next week we'll use a thinner band. Bro, 
out prematurely, but I'll leave it on. So make me make it faster, a faster transition from the working set to the drop set. So I'll leave it on. I'll do as many reps as I can, slow and controlled, and then I'll do some assisted reps. All the way down, all the way up. I want to try to get my shoulders as low as possible, so that when I do a when I do a ring muscle up, even if I don't pull all the way down, I'm still able to push out of it. And the ants, it is right. Ants are fucking eating our feet. Go! So I got four really deep, deep dips. Let's go for the intense shit. He's gonna go shit with her. Go! Leave him. Leave him. I don't want him sitting over there. Who cares? many dips as I could unassisted, which was four, and then I did as many as I could assisted with the band, which was two, and then on the third rep I just pushed for ten seconds, and that's all you need. Once it's a failure, you really feel it in your chest. I really feel it in my chest because I'm bent over. It felt more in his arms because he was standing straight up, so you want to bend over toward more of your chest, and on to the last exercise. Last exercise we do is the tricep push downs. Uh, Aiden did, what did you do last week? 10 reps, 40 pounds. He did 40 pounds for 10 reps, so we're adding 5 pounds to his. So he's doing 45 pounds. Last week I did 9 reps with 70, so I'm going to stay at 70. And let's see what Aiden can do. He's going to do as many as he can, and then I'm going to assist him. And then he's going to do the same for me. It's all very boring, and it's repetitive, and that's what your workout should be. This should be boring, repetitive. But fun, getting getting stronger every week, or losing weight every week, depending on your bulk and your cutting. And let's see what happens. Mike is in school. Noah's in school, and Aiden's in school. Go ahead, and Aiden's in the school of hard knocks. Okay, see how many reps Aiden can do. Other way, other way, other way, other way. Hands the other way. Yeah. Yeah, down, down to your side, down, all the way down. Yeah, and then keep your elbows where they are. Just try to keep your elbows where they are. It's like a curl, but keep but the other direction. Yeah, no, you want to curl in the other direction, like that, yeah, that. Then bring your arms up, 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 down, and down from there. Yeah, five pounds makes a big difference. Like you can swing it a little bit, yeah, swing, you can swing it a little bit. What'd you get there? Okay, keep going. Okay, I'll help you. Maybe 45 is too much. No, I can't. Huh? Okay, go drop the weights. Do a drop. Do a drop. drop. Take off the 2.5s. And then do it again. I think you're swinging a little bit last week with momentum. Go. Let's go again. You're still, it's still working out. Go. It's a lot later, eh? One. Two. See, you're using momentum. Try not to use momentum. Stop, like, stop. Keep your elbow there. Look, look, look. Go down. Go down. Wait, wait, let me go to the wide angle. If I can switch this fucking thing. I'm in trouble going to wide angle. Wait, wait, let me. I'll turn off and go wide angle. We're back at a wide angle. And he's going to work on the technique. Okay, bring the bring the bar down. Bring it down. Bring it down, down, all the way down. You're, you're maxed out? Okay, let me help you. Yeah, that's it. Okay, no. You need assisted reps now. Go. Assisted. Ready? Go, go, go. Assisted. Push, 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 push. Up and that's it from there, from there, from there. Push down, push down, push down, push down. Up again, up again. From there, from there. From there, from there. Push down, push down. Push down, push down, push down, push down, push down. This is the last exercise, so just go out, balls to the wall. Can you do another one? Go, 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 go. Okay, that's it. And that's how it should be. It's your last rep, your last exercise. And that's perfect. Now my turn. Yeah. You have to help me too. Okay. 
Hi everyone, my name is David. Fuck that. Do um, it. Read my technique. So ass out. Arms out. How much is that? Seventy? Yeah. Triceps are burning. I need help you get two sister reps. Yeah. And that's it. Work is finished. Enjoy the rest of your day. Like and subscribe. And come back tomorrow for back and biceps.